Okay, I just want to start by saying I remember the first time Rebecca told me about you. She was showing me pictures on her phone, and after each bout of excitedly telling me how funny and talented and hot you were, she would assure me that this was just a casual thing. <laughs> and I remember laughing and turning to you and seeing that you had this look on your face, and like, you were just like miles away. And at the same time, it's like you had slipped into the most wonderful daydream. You were just completely smitten, and I had never seen you that way before. <laughs> You're gonna be. <laughs> yeah. And suddenly I had the feeling that you wouldn't mind this casual thing going on for a very long time. <laughs> and it feels like a lifetime ago that that happened and that you guys got together. And you write completely different people. And you've grown and changed so much together. <laughs> but the thing that's always stayed the same is that when we talked about you, <laughs> I still catch her getting that look. <laughs> I love that about you guys. And I love that throughout all that life's thrown at you, all the ups and downs and personal growth, there's been so much love between the both of you. And I hope that your love for each other will help you become the people you want to be. Just like having a safety net allows you to leap without fear, your love for each other will help you try without fear, knowing that win, lose, or draw, you'll always have someone supporting you and someone to catch you when you fall. What an amazing gift to give to each other. <laughs> it's an honor to pronounce you husband and wife, and you may kiss. <laughs>